This short training program is designed to review basic safety procedures for those experienced oxygen acetylene welders who already know how to operate the equipment. There are a wide range of potential hazards when using welding and cutting equipment. More training is required. This program concentrates on the equipment and not all the many other hazards associated with welding. First, before beginning your day, inspect equipment, including hoses, regulators, valves, and other assemblies to ensure that they're in good working condition and free of oil before each use. All welders know that oil and oxygen don't mix and can create an explosion if mixed together. Replace or repair damaged or deteriorating equipment. Keep a class ABC fire extinguisher near, as the ABC extinguisher will put out most types of fires, except exotic metal fires, which requires a class D extinguisher. Check for and immediately repair gas or oxygen leaks when preparing to begin welding cutting operations. Use a solution of soapy water or its equivalent to check for leaks. Never use a flame to check for leaks. Never force connections that don't fit. Watch out for connectors with faulty seats. Replace damaged connectors. When lighting the torch, point it away from persons and combustibles. For improved safety, use reverse flow flashback arrestor check valves. The use of check valves on regulators is strongly recommended to reduce the possibility of reverse flow of gas, which can create a dangerous mixture of fuel and oxygen. Mixed gases will burn rapidly once the torch is lighted and can explode in the hoses, regulators, or cylinders, resulting in serious damage to the equipment and or injury to the operator. Reverse flow from one line to another can be caused by a damaged or plugged tip, loss of pressure in one line, a cylinder in use that's empty. Flashbacks. Check valves should be tested for proper function at least every six months. Careless usage, dirt, or abuse can shorten check valve service life and require more frequent testing. Oxygen is natural in the atmosphere. It's produced industrially by distilling air below its freezing point. Oxygen does not burn or explode. However, oxygen is an accelerant. It causes everything it comes in contact with to burn hotter and faster. Oxygen is heavier than air. Acetylene is a compound of hydrogen and carbon. The explosive range is 3.0 to 93%. Acetylene needs only 10% oxygen to ignite. It's produced when calcium carbide is mixed with water. Acetylene is an unstable...